channel today okay sorry you didn't see my beautiful face last week i was really down yeah health wise so i needed that break <laughs> to get myself a little and yeah i'm glad i'm here today healthy yeah which is the most important part of life <laughs> so welcome again to my channel and today <laughs> i will be telling you guys things that guys do that girls hate <laughs> okay note that this is based on my experience and my friends experience and I know that most girls can relate to what I'm about saying right now and the category of guys I'll be calling today are not the ones you are close to or your boyfriend or in you know, the category of guys I'll be calling today are those ones that you are not close to at all or those ones that you just met for the first time the ones that you're trying to get to know whether you guys can get along or the ones that probably want to date you or ask you out <laughs> so i wrote them to like i wrote them down so i won't forget a point <laughs> okay things guys do that girls hate number one is sending your friend over to ask for a girl's number or calling her over to your seat bro how do you even enjoy doing that like how can you send your friend to go and collect a girl's number <laughs> okay you expect the friend to go there tell the girl mm, my friend oh no they usually say this my friend over there is feeling you he wants you to come over he's calling you or he wants to have your number like i feel that is really really disrespectful i don't know why you guys do that okay some guys will say hey, because maybe their friend is shy or something so okay now if i come over or if the girl come over are you not still going to talk to that girl so why not summon the courage to come yourself and collect the girl's number or come yourself and call the girl or start a conversation with the girl rather than send your friend and those friends that normally do those kind of things that go as a messenger <laughs> what is your problem now what is it i don't even like me i don't even answer those kind of things so <laughs> please this is not cool at all it's not cool <laughs> and number two is calling multiple times when a girl doesn't pick up her phone i get tired of this like you call me once you call me twice you call me three times and you are calling me and calling me and calling and calling again what is your problem don't you I mean, can't you see that I, I don't want to pick the call or I'm probably doing something or why do you feel the need to call multiple times and I've had this experience like I gave this guy my number okay back then in school because we were doing registration and I just I went to eat and I wanted him to call me when um, the HOD or the secretary came so I gave my number to call me and since then okay this guy started calling me and calling me and calling even though i i didn't pick the call he calls like multiple times i went ahead to even block him and i still saw signs that he was still trying to reach me like clearly i knew that that guy was really possessed or i don't know obsessed or something but please even though i gave you my number or we are not close don't call me like i am with your kidney please or did you give me something to hold for you please stop it once twice it's okay okay saving grace three times that's all don't call me <laughs> or don't call a girl like that maybe i know like girls and guys are guilty of this but guys please don't do this <laughs> number three is Mm, this one is this one this one <laughs> okay number three is saying i wish i met you before my girlfriend or saying i wish i met you before my wife bro what kind of lie is that <laughs> God. like the guys that do this needs to suffer for 600 years i'm telling you <laughs> what like how is that going to change anything so okay you 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 feel okay when you tell me that when you tell a girl that it's going to change the fact that okay she wants to date you and she's going to you are going to break up i don't even know what you i don't know what you guys think when you say that 
especially that's and that's the height of disrespect you have for your partner. Say, I wish I met you before my girlfriend, and I wish I or I wish I met you before my wife. Mm, mm, mm. Brother, please stop lying. Stop it. Stop it. It's not helpful. Please. <laughs> Just say that because you want to date me or you want to date a girl, it's all cool at all. Please stop that. Ah uh ah, -uh, please. <laughs> okay, number three. Okay, number four is texting someone for the first time and referring to that person as boo, sugar, hey baby. Hey, since when? Like, I just got to know you. Oh, I, I don't know. How would you even do that? Why would you want to text me and call me? I'm not your baby. Please. I find this very offensive. And when you're trying to tell them, please, I don't I don't like that name. Stop calling me that name. They're like, uh-uh. Some some one guy just one guy told me that, okay, uh-uh, I'm this jovial person that I like calling people that name. And I'm like, please, I don't like people calling me that name. Like we are not in a relationship, so stop calling me that name. And the guy was like, ah, oh, I'm not matured enough. I, I'm not really much. Why do you have to break up majority in this? I hate it when I'm trying to tell you I don't like this. Stop calling me this. And you're trying to convince me the reason why you, I should accept the name. Thank <laughs> God. Please. Please, guys, stop it. Stop it. Stop. <laughs> it's not cool. Stop calling someone you're just trying to know. Baby, boo, hey sugar, hey love, hey darling. Are you okay? Something wrong with you? Stop it, please. We don't like it. Okay, I personally don't like it, and I know most girls don't like it because most of my friends have complained about this. So please learn to stay. Be calming down. Don't try to rush things. Please try and be calming down, bro. Please. Okay, number five is being dishonest about your intention for a girl. You see, most guys, eh, they know in their heart, they know that this girl they are about to meet, it's not like they want to have anything serious with them. They just want to have sex and that's all. They know it. But they go ahead and act like they want something serious, like deceiving the girl. And when the girl now falls for it, you now, you now, you now waste her time. Like, stop wasting people's time. You want to have sex with somebody. Like, I know some girls that would actually jump to that offer. Okay, well, cool. Let's do it. That's all. If you don't have a good intention for a girl, please make it known to her. It will be so easy than wasting somebody's time. Don't be a time waster. Please make your intentions and that's it we are okay with that don't be dishonest about it don't you don't have to lie now nobody's going to beat you if you say the truth please try please. I, i'm begging you on this area please be cool try and be very very honest with your intention when you meet a girl thank you very much in advance <laughs> okay over six is requesting pictures <laughs> god Especially for those that you met face to face, like you just met the person for the first time, like you met face to face, okay, you exchange numbers and you're chatting and you're, you're like, send me your, your picture. That is draining. I don't, oh God, I don't know if I'm the only one, no, but <laughs> I don't like it. I don't. Most girls don't. And especially when you are seeing my DP, what do you want to use my picture for? What is it? What do you want to use my pictures for? <laughs> Stop it now. Stop it. Stop requesting for pictures. Uh-uh. You're -uh. seeing my TP. Or if I can if I can actually give you my number. Yeah, you can if you want to see my pictures, you can ask me for my Instagram page or my Facebook or anything and just go right there to see my picture. Please. Uh-uh. Stop requesting pictures. Uh -uh. It's not cool. Be cool. Uh-uh. <laughs> And number seven is <laughs> randomly calling a girl on a video call when you are not 
cool yet with that girl <laughs> why do you feel the need to do this like some guys that's the first time they're chatting you up and then boom it's a video call like you don't have to do this now don't call me on a video call when we are not really close please <laughs> and the last one is acting so desperate okay some guys you're getting to know them and they pour out their intentions to you of how they like and want to date you and you on the other side are sincere with them trying to tell them i'm not interested and then you're like <laughs> I don't mind being the second boyfriend. They are bombarding you with love messages and the rest. Oh, I'm going to take care of you. I'm going to do better than your boyfriend and the rest. Who oh, necessary now? It's not necessary to do this. That's not going to make me date you. So please stop acting desperate. <laughs> okay, guys, I will be stopping here for today. I know there are many things that guys do that girls hate. So please, ladies. If I didn't mention any of them, you can help me comment below. Let's gist about these things. And if you can relate to this, please help me comment below. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. I know this was a little bit long, but it was worth it. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. I'll see you guys next week. Friday.